I'm gonna get a quick flight on this because I gotta take it apart. <laughs> Feel the burn. Wow, look at all the lights in this thing. That's nice. This one, if I get it out there too far, I won't be able to know which way it's going. Definitely wish your lights on the wind tips would blink green and red. But... See, like mine are blinking. Turned it off because actually, you know what? That reverse light is blinding me. Really? Yeah, it's actually brighter than a lot of the other ones. I just gotta figure out what light pattern I want to stick with. You can see it definitely. I want the one where I can see the front blinking light. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, that's what I want. Where I have the blinking light in the front where the motor's at, and then I don't have the reverse light. That reverse light is kind of annoying. It's a little too bright. Yeah. Time remaining, four minutes. Time remaining, five Ah, that was cool. Time remaining, three minutes. I'm gonna have to shoot a landing because it's getting dark.
Landing from the north. Perfect. This is cool. I think I would need to stick a couple more lights on this for darker. Yeah, you get those. I have the easy lights. Yeah, yeah, that's the same. I can Velcro them on the plastic parts on the ends. Even that RV8, that flex plane, I still put more lights on it. Up. I seen one guy online that has this. Um, he put the easy lights on it too. Oh, that looks sweet. Yeah, like I said, it's a flying, it's a flying Christmas tree from underneath. No kidding. Oh, that backup light looks cool. Oh, that's the tail light. Oh, yeah, that's the tail light here. Got a lot of light. See, if I put the, if I do a little bit more, that, eh, I don't know. I mean, it's, it's okay. I turn it to where just that that reverse light is out. And yeah. If I put reverse on, it doesn't do anything. Right, you have to put the mix in. Yeah. I'll have to read up on how to do that. There's a video on it. It's really, really pretty easy. That makes it nice. <laughs> well, what I did that time is I knew I was committing the landing, so I just kind of... Yeah, my air tractor, I keep forgetting that I have reverse. Because I could stop it from rolling off the end of the runway if I go too long. All right, I got a little flaps. Plugs everywhere, it's kind of... Committing to landing. Ooh. That was close. <laughs> you gave me a heart attack. When I hit the freaking gas on that, it just went nose up. Yeah. We'll try that one more time. Full flaps. Nice. There we go. <laughs> it's got a lot of power though. I was able to just juice it and go. It's controllable. Yeah, it's got a lot of power to get out of trouble if you use it. I mean, literally with those flaps all the way down, you hit that gas, it just goes straight up. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Just got to figure out how to do that. Uh, try and put the reverse light. You can see the control panel inside this thing. Oh, sweet. Oh, man. All right. Motor's off. Cool. Yeah, that's one little add. That's a nice little added, added thing they did to it. 
It's got lights there. Right? You can probably even see it through the back, can't you? Yeah. Yeah. I just wish those, I mean, the, the white lights blink on the end. You know what? I mean, they should have just made the ends just red and green and blink. Mm -hmm. Maybe had it where you could dial it and you could turn them off with either solid or blinking. Well, they got a little blinky next yeah. to it, and it's not very bright. So it's off. And the first one is just green with some uh, flashing at the bottom. Yeah. And then if I go up a little bit more, yeah, so it just flashes a little bit of white there. A little bit more, put the, the tail light comes on. A little bit more, you get more lights at the bottom. Then you get those landing lights. Those that, are, that shine on the ground. Those are super bright and I love them. Yeah. That really helps this low light. And I noticed when it's coming in over there, there's a point where, you, okay, where are the wheels? You know, because yeah. it's dark. <laughs> yep. So this mode is everything but the, the tail light. Actually, I mean the reverse light. Yeah. I kind of like this mode because it shows the nose and it blinks underneath here, which is fine. I'd almost, I think I'm going to switch the green with those white blinking lights and flip flop those for the next time so the green and the red flash on this mode and I think it'll be perfect because if yeah. I just have, I'll have all solid white lights underneath and the two landing lights on the wingtips. Yeah. As long as that blinking one on the nose, I mean it's, it's something, it doesn't blind you, it's on and off enough. It gets a little bright. Yeah, the, uh, like it the blinking lights on the tips of this one really save you so that you know how it's oriented. Yes. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. That's why I put a lot of those. I put those same things on most of the, even my planes that have lights. Yeah. I put those extra lights on there just, just so I can see more. Dance club mode. Wow. <laughs> Come out on the Maybe you could theoretically put find a three position switch here. switches I'm, I'm not i don't use any dual rates for rudder uh -huh. so i could use the switch on the left side here and just have three light modes instead of having the dial the dial's nice but there's i don't use all the modes i think like a landing mode and then like all lights on mode and then off yeah uh, yeah you know that may be something as simple as that so there's really only two modes So this camera lasted through three long flights, so, and it's still got power. But in the winter time, it craps out really quick. 